Okay, so uh, my tablet decided to cancel on my prior film, which really pisses me off because it's trying to force me to download an app so they could spy on me, which I'm not buying into. Uh, just so you could see their little uh, shot glasses that I'm making candles of, and you could see the stuff that I'm using, right, that I got online. And uh, this over here, these are tapes, this over here. These are tapes, bottom tapes, so you could tape the bottom of these thingies onto here. They don't just stand by itself. Okay, so I'm starting this whole film all over again. And so here's another candle that I'm, I'm working on, and I put the charcoal felt in the center just like on the other one. The other one has it from the bottom up. This one has it only midway up to the top, but the charcoal felt should not burn and if, it, and if it does burn, it'll be a very slow burn, and it should uh, handle a lot of hours there. And then, as you can see, I have another shot glass, which is a pretty big lot shot glass for a shot glass, if you want to call it a shot glass. And then a tall shot glass there. And what we're doing, as you can see, um, scooting on over here, uh, this over here is a spoon with beeswax in it and over here I am melting my beeswax I got this little piece for like two dollars over at Salvation Army as you can see it is starting to melt but it takes a good half hour and I am excited about doing this again I just want to show you the first time around when I did it I did not use uh, the melting pot that I used this time but instead I used this one this thing from like a dollar store that had a pour spout in it and it was really sitting on the pot underneath and that pot underneath was sitting on a, another pot with water and that's how I did it that time. The problem is that when I poured it on the sink, although it's not really a problem with the method that I used. Oops. It was actually uh, a problem with me being a klutz. And so um, this time I'm using a basin and I'm putting plastic over it. And I have it very adjacent to the hot pot, the warming pot, so I could just bring it over, scoot it over and pour it. And uh, it's going to spill, obviously, the way it spilled over here in the right place and not the wrong place. So thank you so much for watching. I hope that you can appreciate what I have done here and appreciate the fact that uh, I showed you one made candle. I may not show you all the other ones. This is still hot, actually. It's just getting hard. As you can see, the, the charcoal felt is right in the center. And hopefully that charcoal felt will be a slow burn. Because you see the pieces of wood? That didn't really work well for me. Oh, look at that. It's got a crack on it. That's kind of weird. I hope that's not going to be a problem. never seen a candle with a crack on top of it. But anyway, uh, it's probably because I pulled it and I tugged the what I used over here to hold it up like this. I it, it was stuck, and that's probably what caused the crack. But I hope it's not a problem. Maybe I'll pour a little bit more wax over it. Uh, and as you can see, I have three more jars there, and the stickies, the white thing, is little round stickies for the bottom of the wicker, the wick to stand. And I'm really excited about my my project. Again, I lost the other recording. So this about <clears throat> six years ago cost $7.99. It was not beeswax. Uh, today, it not being beeswax probably would be $15. Um, I never use and don't uh, stay away from the nicely scented ones, which this was a Christmas candle like pine tree because it's cancerous. And it's the same uh, thing they use on cigarettes, which causes... Um, Addiction. It's not nicotine. What causes addiction, by the way? Okay. And uh, if you have any comments, or you have any questions about that, please put it in the comment section. So I'm very, very proud of my candle. As you can see, the felt is in between the two pieces of wood because the wood doesn't really burn slow. Really odd. It crackles, but it burns a little too fast and it starts digging a hole in the center of the candle. I prefer something and I'm trying to experiment here not seen anybody do use a felt with a Coles felt uh, before, but I think it's going to work. 
Thank you so much for so much for watching and have a great day. When I do burn them, I'll probably upload another uh, video showing it burning and hopefully it'll be a slow burn when we do. Thank you so much and have a great day. Bye now.